Disraeli support for the artisan vote was dependent upon its connection to multiple franchises, thus to promote his party at time of election. The crowds gathering to cheer Garibaldi is the hero of Italian unification. Knew how far from inclusion in the present constitution they were. Until the patience that laid off mill workers displayed was for Gladstone a revelation. And when Palmerston died for such men, franchise the spur. But Ren Pear's exclusion with the Dolomite collusion left the liberals so deeply divided. But glance and loath the tussle advised that Lord Russell resign. Yet when hungry and sad, the crowds called for Gladstone and Liberty Disraeli decided to dish the Whigs he must see the Tory party realign. But it was Gladstone's speech that ventured to preach Let every man not by some personal unfitness estranged Is morally entitled to come within The pale of the Constitution Notwithstanding sudden or intoxicating change But on the speaker summons the bill to make the Commons more popular and independent was destined on its way to pass out of Disraeli's control. For twelve month ten pound lodgers augmented by Hodgkinson's rent rate compounding amendment would add a million more borough artisans of the electoral roll. By contrast, in the counties, just twelve and five pound leaseholders were newly enfranchised. Hence, proportionately fewer newer voters in counties and towns. And since, with boroughs given twenty of the forty-five seats, the next election proved a liberal landslide. This really took the chagrin had failed to take Gladstone's crown. For it was Gladstone's speech that had brought within reach political devolution. That every man, not by some personal unfitness estranged, is morally entitled to come within. The pale of the Constitution, notwithstanding violent or intoxicating change. Yet the bill, though not small, didn't warrant the call of a leap in the dark by Derby. There was still no consistency in overall constituency size. There could not without a ballot be confidentiality persuasion still figuring largely And no way with ease even middle class MPs could rise and Thus it would continue, no salary, no sinew And though property was no longer needed Campaigning ran up bills with insufficient contributions to war Universal manhood suffrage required much greater leverage and no female voters yet conceded. While Bill's commons might pass, still couldn't bypass laws. And yet Gladstone's speech had opened the breach to political devolution. That every man not by some personal unfitness estranged. 
morally entitled to come within the pale of the Constitution, notwithstanding excessive or intoxicating change.